I think the major challenge for IRI is that uh, IRI has been uh, a center of excellence in science, in developing products, in, de in developing technology, in sharing those technology, in supporting NAS and ARI. That is the strength of IRI. Uh, and IRI has to ensure the biggest challenge is how do we maintain those kind of uh, excellence in science, all those factors and how efficiently we deliver those products. Uh, keeping in view that uh, some of the NARs are also becoming very strong, although some NARs are still weaker in terms of their uh, manpower training, capacity building, like those kind of things. But uh, I am sure IRI will continue to be the uh, center of uh, excellence in rice science and uh, if, let me say, if uh, whatever we have a bird, ri bird rice community today in 1980s and uh, this would, if IRI was not there, I am sure we, we may not have obtained such a bird rice scientific community, not only IRI, the whole. And uh, we have to play that vital role in the same sense. In future, we have to maintain or excel even beyond what we have been doing earlier. So that is the biggest challenge. How do we project ourselves uh, to be a world class uh, rice science center uh, to support the whole world scientific community, whether it is a NARS or ARI. Then in terms of our in plant beading, IRI has to make sure that uh, uh, plant beading efforts are translated in developing useful pre-breeding products considering those climatic changes, funding shortages and other aspects on so many problems uh, associated with rice, technology, breeding. But one of the major challenge for IRI is how effectively IRI continues to deliver pre-breeding products as it has delivered in the past. Same for developing breeding products. And the second uh, major challenge for plant breeding is that uh, they have to, plant breeding group has to ensure that uh, we do provide a, a good capacity building role and good knowledge uh, to the partners or uh, manpower training, whether it is a degree or non-degree training. We should still be the hub of best possible training in rice science, uh, breeding, even other subjects related. And the third is uh, maybe for ERI that ERI would continue to be serve as a repository for the germplasm because we have the excellent uh, gene bank and we have to play that role and now since uh, we have better technique to characterize diversity and other things, so the other community can make better use of that uh, gene bank more efficiently in gene discovery, in basic research and applied research, but it has to ensure that we continue to play that role. So I would say that uh, uh, they have to be on the forefront for pre-breeding products for capacity building, for sharing better germplasm and technologies. And they, these are the four major challenges. And uh, uh, also the new tools, they have to make sure that uh, they become available. Take a very simple example. If ERI takes a lead in pyramiding genes for BPH, bacteria blight, abiotic stresses, just pre-breeding and gives those products to the NARS, that will be the biggest contribution and challenge which uh, other groups are facing. So, IRI may have to ensure that uh, we capture all new knowledge of genomics, plant breeding, agronomy, whatever subject is and then we give that kind of package. We continue to give that kind of package time to time with the new developments uh, to the uh, farming community or to the NARS. Take example and uh, we are very fortunate that our NARS are so uh, accepting the technology. Take the example of Philippines. We are so fortunate that uh, our host country is supporting uh, so much to ERI, like RSSP, Rice Self-Sufficiency Program, we have such a strong collaboration. UPLB is providing best possible students for uh, degree training and ERI is uh, making uh, use of that facility and it is, it is uh, that activity and it is helping both the scientific world as well as in manpower training. So we have to maintain those kind of uh, uh, four or five aspects rather excel in future because we have now better knowledge and better tools, yes.